The New Jersey Department of Education has identified CAR, the Connected Action Roadmap, as its vision for teaching, leading, and learning in New Jersey schools, and has now developed a pilot program utilizing the CAR framework to build the capacity of New Jersey educators to work effectively in professional learning communities, using the blended online learning modules to deepen their PLC work. 34 New Jersey schools are taking part in this pilot program, including some elementary, middle, and high schools from North, Central, and South Jersey. One of these CAR pilot schools is Janice Dismas Middle School in Englewood. Both the administrators and teachers agree that CAR has made a big difference. Principal Lamar Thomas credits Rosemary Seidel Supervisor of Educational Technology for her relentless campaign to bring CAR to Dismas. Um, because she worked so um, intensely in this building, she began to kind of unpack it to help us to see um, the benefits of going forward, how this can become part of our generational work. And I'm the first person to say that I initially <laughs> felt like, nah, this is, no, nah, I'm not exactly sure, but she stayed on me, she kept working on me to help me to see that if my mantra truly is that we're preparing the school for beyond ourselves, then you cannot go around um, this CAR model. Well, for me, CAR provides a cohesive framework to lead the growth of student uh, engagement and student learning and teacher effectiveness in the classroom. And it uses culture as the basis for the work. As a new superintendent in this district, it was where does it fit into our strategic plan of how do we move things. And as, as more and more things became evident of having to get everybody on that same page for that long-term growth, it was a, the right model to choose. And especially for this school that was really looking for that. They had, as one, again, they mentioned the core values. How do you bring that together to everybody on the same page? And that's what they started to do when they talked about the car model here. We had to trust in the process. We had to trust in our teachers um, that they would flourish in this um, and we also ask that they trust us that this is not just another uh, you know initiative we're just slapping on for this year once we went to that first workshop and we really like understood what this was I was like oh this is something that we should be doing like everybody should be doing this this is awesome I can't wait to implement this I was surprised at how quickly everyone got on board because I was nervous when I first went to the training thinking that some teachers would be like oh here we go another PLC thing that we have to do but I think with the online part component to it everyone was like engaged in what was coming next as a teacher, you know, you're always being given something new to try out. Well, this is the new thing you're going to do now. Up until this point, I think it's been compliance. But with this, it's, it's more, I have a vested interest in it. So we had all these pieces, just no one ever put them together. So one of the things we did was, in a, really introducing it to the staff, was saying, this is not something new. You've done all of this. Now we're just bringing it together and showing the connectivity between all these pieces. And once it was laid out in that fashion, I think we didn't get too much of the resistance because as we worked through the process and we worked through the modules for ourselves and for the staff, it was, hey, I've done that or I've seen that, but now I see, now that it's not in isolation, I see the power of it. I just had to put it with the right pieces. While CAR is certainly not new, it is clearly transformational, and the administrators agree that common language and coherence play a key role. I would say the coherence. The, the metaphor really speaks to a person. And the conversation is, if you look at the triangle, is something that's been promoted in this school in particular. Now we had a way to look at it that it has to be tight, very tightly together, because if those sides open up or those boundaries, then pieces in the middle, the balls in the middle, if you will, start to roll out. And so what the car helped us to do is when you shift that language just a little bit, now we all have common language. And we're not saying things that kind of sound similar, we're actually saying the same thing. You know, all that work that Mr. Thomas has done to train the teachers has really guided us to, you know, get the car going and getting on the highway. And the collaborative piece, I think, in anything you can take away, that together we can always achieve more and learn more. And it really has shown people the difference between professional development and professional learning. This is ongoing, job-embedded, 
shared leadership, learning from one another, and and for a new teacher, being in a PLC with veteran teachers yes. is the best professional learning you can ever ask for. So being able to collaborate with other teachers um, helps anyone, uh, and just showing that that you can work together and you can find unity in something um, really helps in the car model to show that. I feel less stressed this mm -hmm. year <laughs> than I have in the past because I feel like we're all on the same page for like the first time and we're talking and having these conversations. We have the time to have these conversations. It's not just rushed in the hallway like, hey, by the way, I wanted to ask you about what, where you are right now. Like, So it's it's, yeah, it's less stressful too. It makes our jobs easier. Also making PLC work easier are the blended online learning modules, a series of videos designed to help educators use CAR most effectively. Last year I went to the training so I was introduced to the videos and the first video that actually got me hooked was the collaboration with the two teachers to get them on the same page so I was like, oh my gosh, like I want to do that with my counterpart. So then Perez is new to the school this year so I like grabbed her and was like, listen, <laughs> this is what we're going to do. The blended online learning modules have every resource you could want. It becomes a real database a resource repository of best practice information. All the videos are short, right. which is great. It makes them very user friendly. And what was great is because the videos are, the brevity of the videos, it allows for conversation to unpack the videos. And that's where some of the richness came out in those conversations with our staff. Everyone at Dismiss School agrees that CAR has been a resounding success that will pay big dividends for students and teacher leaders in the future and they universally recommend CAR to other schools. We all have a destination we want students to get to, right? It's different for everybody, but we always know what the end goal is. We don't always know how to get there. What CAR does is it facilitates that. It gives you all the tools and the CAR to get there. I know that the CAR model will be very effective, uh, very helpful in high school, um, because uh, we, we teach, uh, in math, we teach things by subject, but you still need <coughs> effective interaction. Um, and I think you get much more effective interaction with the car model. I would say definitely put the keys in, turn on the car, <laughs> and give it a go. Um, you know, it's a hard process. Change is always hard, but you have to keep the faith in the process and really believe and trust in your staff and the administrators that together we can achieve whatever that goal is. And I think that car really does that for you.